Much like the Silent Swordsman archetype, there was actually a Silent Magician counterpart archetype, which was a series of spellcasters that was actually used by Yugi Moto in the anime. And this ranged from a baby Silent Magician level 4 to a grown up Silent Magician level 8, which was really, really cool that this was actually a game promo as well. I remember receiving this as a kid, and it was just so, so cool to have a 3500 beater that I could not summon out of my deck no matter how hard I tried. Now, the crazy part about this whole entire thing is a couple of years later or I should say over 10 years later as far as I'm aware there was actually a retrain of Silent Magician level 4 which looked a little bit more promiscuous than the other Silent Magicians to say the least but hey I'm not complaining this card is actually competitively viable in some way because you can actually summon it by tributing any spellcaster and then she negates a spell card activation I don't know I think this card could actually be played in competitive Yu-Gi-Oh what do you guys think about this card